my career stretched uh, over 20 years now at, at, as a professional and um, obviously there's got to be, I'm doing something right <laughs> and I got a bit of longevity that uh, has been good for me. Um, first of all, you know, I, you got to look after your body a little bit, try and stay in fairly good shape where you can swing the club athletically. You, you need flexibility obviously. But uh, the things that I always fall back on to uh, when I practice with weeks off or even when I play tournament golf is, um, is just the basic uh, fundamentals, you know? So I'd, I'd like to help you through those. First of all, very important on the driver to have your ball position correct. You don't want the ball position past your left toe, which is too far up in your stance. That, uh, that's going to probably tend you to, to stay behind the ball too long. You don't want to be too far back like when you're hitting a five iron. Um, the ball is teed up, so you always have a perfect lie. I've got uh, eight and a half degrees on my Callaway driver here. Uh, so that's more than enough loft to get the ball in the air. So I want, I'd like to get the ball just inside my left heel, inside my left leg. That's my ball position on my driver. And then from there, my width of my stance is about just on the inside of my shoulders. So uh, the inside of my legs, inside of my shoulders. So that gets me into a nice, comfortable position. There's a little bit of knee flex. I like to have a straight back, uh, you know, on my, on my stance, on my address position. And then uh, what I also like to do is feel like my arms are hanging from my shoulders. It's just hanging from my shoulders. There's not a lot of tension in my, in my forearms. So I'm pretty light in the grip. Give it a couple of waggles. And um, I like to get my left shoulder on the backswing. I like to get that behind the ball. That gets me into a good position on the backswing. And from there on, it's just two turns. You're turning back and turning through the ball. And then my, my move back is to slide the club through my arm, slide the club back, and get this shoulder to behind the ball. And from here, you can turn your shoulders. And now you've made a nice big turn. From there, you come into the ball nice and shallow and clip it off the tee. You know, I play in a lot of programs and people ask me, what do you think at the change of direction? You know, from your backswing, top of your backswing, to start of your downswing. And um, I always try and feel that I'm, you know, I've made my full turn, get my shoulder behind the ball. And from here, it feels like my left arm and the shaft is just dropping. It's just falling down to the, to the floor. So you, Although, I mean, I'm doing it in, in the motion here, yeah, your swing is moving. So you feel from here, the club is falling. So it's just falling from your shoulder down in turn. So really, basically, to recap, um, try and keep yourself in pretty good shape. It's very uh, important to do flexibility exercises to, so that you can turn. Whenever you can turn, you'll hit the ball a long way. And then go through your fundamentals. Go through your, your posture, nice straight back, athletic position, your ball position with the driver always inside your, your left leg, your left heel. Get your left shoulder when you're turning behind the ball. Let the club head drop from the top and follow through to a nice camera finish. And hopefully we'll extend your career by another couple of years. So enjoy.